Well, hello to everybody. Welcome to our coverage of the first day of the competition. It may be an overused phrase, but uh, everyone really does start out equal on this day. Stature and reputation and history all irrelevant, albeit momentarily. This is the game everybody, no matter who they support, can be just a little bit hopeful about. Maybe it's their turn, just maybe. And there really are few places on earth quite like this. The grand cathedral of football that is the Giuseppe Miazzi. The lineup we have suggests it's going to be a 4 5 1 formation, Jim. Well, this setup, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protective layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter attacks. If you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot, it can have a, a devastating effect, actually, uh, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. So it's away we go then. It looked as though that might lead to something quite promising, but it turned out that that was not the case. And he'll shoot here. It's run loose. Who's going to... There's the hit! It's loose now and they want to get it back. Manchester United would very much seem to be growing their confidence here. You can feel it. Tries to dink it in. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Mark andre to Stegen. He's got everything you'd want from a top-level keeper. Great shot-stopping, but also a, a very cool head and, and a good organiser. What's more, he's very happy to play sweeper-keeper behind that defence, mopping up loose... Real chance! Oh, the ball's run loose here. Ter Stegen trying to keep this in. Has a shot! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Manchester United with the corner, their first. Cleared without hesitation. Robertson looks for the finish. Well, now it's a race for the ball. Massive leap! Goal! Manchester United! What a great header, got plenty on that. Yeah, he makes those runs with, with great stealth and a ghost-like arrival to get his head to the ball. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Played out to the right. He is through here. And he'll shoot here. A potential goal of the season contender, if only. On the threshold of perfection, just not this time. Now it's Chiesa. Interesting ball. Oh, perfectly measured that. Kunde with the clearance. 
They need to play this quicker in transitions like this. Gundogan. Now it's Lewandowski. Oh, good spread. He's found a way through to Jong. De Bruyne. Out to the right. Tries a shot! Loose ball. He can pounce on that. Another chance. In for the pieces. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. <laughs> Martinez. And if you have just joined us, still just one goal between them. 1-0 the score. Great ball and he's in here. Garnacho! They've done it! Two up now and they are cruising. The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Well, it's a nice idea, but the execution was lacking. And there's his chance to lead the counter. He's looking for the runner here. Oh, nicely intercepted. João Cancelo. Now oh, it's Gundogan. Well, there was an element of promise insofar as they kept the ball well, but they did very little with it. Over to the left. Now it's Pedri. And that's a throw in. Oh, well played. That has snuffed out the danger. Oh, he's fizzed it forward. Garnacho. Well time. Excellent interception. Now it's Lewandowski. Played out towards the right wing. Chiesa, who does have an assist to his name. Alexander Arnold. He's shifting through the gears here. Chooses to go back. And the shot! In he goes again! They want to be quick to recover. It's Kroos! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, the invitation was there, so he was right, in my opinion, to take it on. Alas, it was a, a technical flaw. Pedri. Well, it just petered out. No penetration at all, having had a great deal of the ball. Out to the left it goes. Now it's Chiesa. Chiesa! It's loose now and they want to get it back. Well, it's a poor throw that, picked off with relative ease. Lofted upfield. And that'll be the last act of the first half. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Manchester United ahead 2-0, and they are looking good.
And that's the start of another 45 minutes. It's a pretty loose pass. Hoisted in. Oh, delightful ball. And he's through one off. He's tried one. Oh, surely that deserved better. The timing of the pass and run was exquisite. Pedri. No, he's not getting his way this time. Oh, he's enjoyed that. He evidently loves the contest. Cruz gets a foot in here. Gundogan. Well seen. Saw that coming. Jao Cancelo calmly anticipates. Pedri. De Jong. If they want to counter, they could do with more speed. Jao Cancelo has been caught there. It's a foul. Jao Cancelo. Christensen. And here's Lewandowski. That has been cut short. Out to the right. Keeper's ball. And he cuts out the supply. Gets his pass away. Garnacho. Oh, what a mistake! Towering header! They are rampant! And they are cruising away! A oh, lovely header, but really it was all about the delivery. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully <laughs> made, it really was. Mm -hmm. 3-0, and things are starting to look awfully cosy. Driving on and making good progress. He's gone for goal! Oh, my word, that is quite something! Oh, it really is a finish of the highest order! Comfort, yet more comfort, easing away. Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. Manchester United totally rampant here. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Casemiro gets across and deals with it. Can he get away here? And the shot! It's loose and there's a race for the ball. And he's there to belt it away. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had... Good options around him, and he failed to get his head up. Over to the left. Petri. The ball has bounced loose now. Now it's De Jong. Chance to break. Good spot. He's seen the run. And that interception was most necessary. And for a moment, you felt that was... Yeah, he's fouled him there. Attention, un cambio.
Time then for the first substitution of the game. And the break in play means they can now affect their change. Yeah, I think the manager might have feared his team could become a little tentative, conservative even, Peter. But this will make a nice change. And it's Lewandowski. Now it's Chiesa. He's through, he's through, it's one and the finish! And that's why... Spirited to say the least, certainly gave this crowd something to really cheer about. Defending was strong and firm. Got a shot away. Oh, denied at the last. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong may come right. Their second corner now. Manchester United with another chance from a corner. So, third corner of the game. Great leap! Oh, it's come back out! And he hits the net! He's getting ridiculous, borderline crazy. Well, it's a goal fest, and the fact it's so one-sided now is, is getting scary. Well, it's an inspired substitution, <laughs> terrific move by the boss. I think the manager's claiming an assist here. Things looking so easy, almost too easy here. Smoothly does it. Madison. Madison! Benzema. Sergio Roberto with the clearance. It's Kroos! Oh, he really got hold of that. It was more possible than probable, and the outcome backed it up, Peter. Young and it's Kundawan. And he was quick to react. Pedri, Rudiger, Mbappe is firing after that one. And it's Tony Kroos. And that's been intercepted. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. <laughs> Martinez. No, he's not getting past him there. Now it's Benzema. Benzema! Oh, the ball's run loose here. He'll try to keep this alive. And that's been won straight back. Chiesa. He's going for goal! Now, who's going to be first to this? Laid out to the left flank. Ter Stegen claims it.
And he's in on goal. It's Benzema! It's there! And so clear that one side are so much better. The scoreline entirely justified. Well, I think we've reached the point when even damage limitations is, is no longer an option. Turns back here, probably the best option. Oh, he's felt that, hasn't he? Looking for the runner. Well, it's a move of great promise, but will it really prove productive? And a header! And yes, it's there! And it adds further to a heavily one-sided scoreline. This is getting punishing. Look, all they want to hear right now is the final whistle. They've been humiliated. And with that, the hat-trick is complete. Well, he's made this game all about him, he's got a fantastic appetite for goals. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and... And that will be the final act. Manchester United have won big and in style. Everything went for them. Their poor opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. Benzema reflecting on a stellar performance and now taking home a permanent reminder for his mantelpiece. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Manchester United showed us why it's so important to seize the initiative. Once in front, they grew in belief and, and rarely looked at risk. Well, that's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.
Well, a very good evening to you wherever you are. I do hope that you can join me in appreciating this truly beautiful evening, a night that is absolutely ideal for a game of football. The scenes here really are something, a beautiful picture under the floodlights, traffic and transport round here, not the kindest, but regardless of that, the fans have found a way of getting here. There is a sense of theatre and the decibel levels are rising. And we are absorbing the energy emanating from the stands of this grand stadium that is the Giuseppe Miazza. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Well, I think the fact that this guy, Saliba, is starting, I think that indicates, Peter, you're looking to play out from the back, and he's shown to be very confident and comfortable on the ball when it comes to moving it forward. He'll see a lot of the ball, and sometimes he'll go direct from back to front. No argument from me on that front. It's uh, easy to see how his presence alone affects both sides. So off we go then. Erdegaard. White has it in a wide position. Saka. He's left his man. And that's played in low. Pinned towards the front line. They've got to make this nice and quick. He's shifting through the gears here. Oh, not quite. Now looking to orchestrate a counter. White. Saka. Robertson. He could be in here. Rice. Threads one in. That's positional goals, the utilisation of space. Tries to crash through the challenge, but no. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw, some real no-nonsense defending. Great leap! That's a half-decent try. Yeah, he may have snatched it down a bit, even though it was quite close. And he can clear it away. That'll be a throw-in. Robertson is very much the model of the modern-day fullback. Gets his pass away. De Bruyne! Oh, did I! Brilliantly! De Bruyne is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Manchester United with the corner, there first. And he's gone looking for safety. Oh, facing up to his adversary, this is a formidable matchup. It's a promising position. Point blank header! 
opts to play it back and he was alert to it away from immediate danger Martinelli Trossard and he has been fouled there and the referee has shown him a yellow card Looking for options for movement. No, whistle's gone, that's a foul. Well, that's a booking, always looked it. Had a great opportunity to open the scoring here. He'll fancy himself from here. He's gone for it! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. That is a really good chance, Miss Peter. Certainly the way he's been playing. Stood up well to him there. Goes back. Tony Kroos. It's a sharp little ball here. Great hit! Goal! Manchester United! Manchester United take the lead! Yeah, the pass was bang on, and he just had to ensure he didn't stray offside. The finish was actually bang on, too. Manchester United. Assegnato al ventottesimo minuto, numero nove. Manchester United draw first blood here. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. And here's Crow. Speculative strike. It's run loose. Who's going to get there? A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Chiesa. And here's a chance. He's got away with one there really was just waiting to pounce on any slip-up and he was gifted a chance. Martinelli. There will be a throw-in. Now that looks a decent ball. Garnacho! Oh, surely that deserved better. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Oh, what a ball is in here! Udegaard played out to the left flank. Rudiger kept aware and it is reclaimed easily. Out to the right. And he's taking no chances there. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. A 
It's a goal kick. White into the final five minutes of the first half. And if you have just joined us, still just one goal between them. 1-0 the score. Looking for the runner. Look, it's a, it's a run defence is this like, but the timing has to be spot on. Played into space out wide. And he's in on... It's Kroos! Really well taken goal. And this is getting better and better. And that is fabulous. A true beauty of a goal. Well, the ball flight may be unpredictable, but the predictable part was the technique. It screamed goal all the way. starting to look very comfortable that second goal is such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods I mean one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three short changes him with that pass aimed beyond the defense Gabriel and it's half time here How's the first half compared with your expectation? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Manchester United in control at half time, 2 0. So off we go once more. Trossard, he's away. And the shot. And in again. No mistake. And the second half is off to a flyer. And he's only too grateful to capitalise on the keeper's misfortune. Well, that's not the best attempt by the keeper, and he's just paid the ultimate price, hasn't he? This is threatening to become a really good game. A scoring early in this half just takes the pressure off now and allows them a chance to be a bit more patient. And he's had a hit! Goal! He knows it's taken a big and very kind deflection, but he is claiming it nonetheless. So the lead now is two. Well, everything is going to plan, Peter. A day for a, a regular managerial heartbeat, at least for one. Well, that pass isn't the best. And there's his chance to lead the counter. Fiddles it through. Up to meet it! And it's there! And surely that settles it.
all over in seconds. That's what they can do to you. Quick, decisive and unerring. A textbook example of, of how to turn defence into counter-attack. That'll do for me every time. And yes, it's him again. Manchester United blast themselves into a three-goal lead. Well, that's really winded the opposition. You can see their manager screaming on the touchline, telling his team to calm down. But they'll need to do that pretty quickly. It's composure from here. Garnacho! It's loose now, and they want to get it back. And that has kept the keeper on his toes. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. It's their second corner of the game. Goes in for the header! It's in! Yet another goal in an awesome performance! They are in complete charge! Oh, whose goal is that? Big deflection. That's one for the dubious goals panel. Manchester United totally rampant here. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Gets his pass away. This is what good chemistry is all about. Well, he got rid because he was under pressure. And it's Tony Kroos. And here's De Bruyne. Look at the... Tries a shot! And he seemed certain to get the sixth. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Good reason for optimism here. Manchester United with another chance from a corner. Manchester United get their fourth corner. Climbs up big! And he's spooned it over the bar. Succumbs to the pressure. Uh, that's been intercepted. It's run loose here. Chiesa. Martinelli. So what can they make of this? He's found the way through. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Manchester United choosing to make the first change. Attenzione, una sostituzione. Havertz. Martinelli. Some good work on the right flank here. 
Good spot, he's seen the run. De Bruyne. Footballing with usually identifies with... Massive leap! That's just playing it safe and simple. White. It's a decent chance to counter-attack. Rice wins the duel this time. Now the counter. And it's De Bruyne. Arsenal needed that. They really needed it. You know, it was an intervention that had to be made. Serious trouble lay in store. Well, he's going to be pulled back for that one. And no surprise, that's a booking. Look, we can't say that's a surprise, Peter. He knew what the consequences were. He really did. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Numero 4, numero 15. Well, he caught that pure, but no end product. Havertz. Challenged just a bit on the firm side. Chance to break. Mbappe. He's going for goal! Not out the best in the keeper. Another example of how comfortable this team is on the break. Sostituzione per l'Arsenal. Numero 29. Manchester United, they're up to five corners now. Numero 5. Back when it goes. Decent hit! And he hits the net! They are getting horribly bullied, and it seems there is plenty more to come. Yeah, it has become ugly for one, but the other is still delivering beauty. Goal for Manchester United. Segnato al 73 minuto, numero 27. Manchester United tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Out to the left it goes. Looking for the runner. Looking for options for movement. And he smashes that clear. And that's clear cut. It's a free kick. Oh, he's felt that, hasn't he? And that could set him on his way. Chiesa. Big chance! And he can't find the net. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. Zinchenko. Excellent challenge there, uncompromising. For Rice. Chiesa. Threads one in. There really wasn't very much in that, not far away from being a telling final ball Manchester United clearly didn't help themselves by telegraphing that one it was always going to be intercepted Rudiger they want to be quick here it's breakaway time 
Well, that looks a decent ball. Now the finish! It's there! And this is getting ridiculous. Borderline crazy. Well, I think we've reached the point when even damage limitations is, is no longer an option. Odegaard. And the counter is on. Chiesa really added the width there, thanks to... Great chance! He's got a goal! And so clear that one side are so much better. The scoreline entirely justified. Look, all they want to hear right now is the final whistle. They've been humiliated. And he's done it again. He's got his second. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Alexander Arnold. Chiesa gets into some space. Gets away from it. Can he finish? Oh, the ball's run loose here. Cross to the back post. And he's cleared it back out. And that's that. Manchester United, very much the dominant side, almost the only side. Every time they got on the ball, they looked like scoring. It is a landslide. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Look, this is a team that doesn't look as if it's daunted away from home. They were organised and determined, and they can surprise again if that standard is maintained. My thanks to Jim alongside me, and as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you. Signore e signori, vi ricordiamo che non è consentito parcheggiare intorno allo stadio. Grazie della collaborazione. Well, good evening wherever you are on this most pleasant evening. As you can see, there's been a, a terrific atmosphere here. There is great expectation, excitement, and it has built nicely in these idyllic conditions. Conditions which are certainly playing their part in creating a glorious ambiance. It's quite a struggle to get in here. Points of access hard to come by and an awful lot of people gathering to get through the gates but regardless of that there's a great feel here and much excitement for the game ahead and there really are few places on earth quite like this the grand cathedral of football that is the Giuseppe Miazza it is our understanding that they've gone with a 4-5-1 well most teams that use this system Peter will work it in a, a way where Yes, they'll have a 4-5-1 shape off the ball and ideally a 4-3-3 shape on it. We often see that 4-1-4-1 shape too and that has an obvious flexibility about it. It's a, it's a popular managerial selection because of that. It's just extremely flexible.
with all the numbers I've mentioned. So we're up and running. And he cuts out the supply. And here's De Bruyne. A real chance! And again! It's there! Well, they would have been looking at him to produce the goods. And that was very kind of him to oblige so early. He knows it's taken a big and very kind deflection, but he is claiming it nonetheless. I doubt very much that this was in the script. Sane. And here's the chance to counter. Chiesa! Oh, taken with style. Two, and we've barely begun here. Manchester United clearly executed that with considerable confidence. It only took seconds to score once the ball was recovered. Manchester United get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even... Chiesa! There's the shot! And collective relief etched on the faces of the defenders. That's just front foot enforcement. Pressure leads to mistake, leads to chance. Spread out to the left. He's been picked out. Rusiala. And it's Goretzka. Kane showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. He's tried one! What a hit! What a hit! A rocket and some! to a finish, an absolute joy, a quite incredible spell, they are flying. Yeah, I'd call that transition with bite, they won it back and a bit hard. Manchester United find a position of real strength now. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Upa Meccano. Cruz. Chiesa. Driving forward. Chiesa! Kane. And that is as far as they're going to go. Garnacho! Now, who's going to be first to this? A 
well played. That has snuffed out the danger. Dyer. And it's Goretzka. Manchester United upping the intensity here, having lost possession. Yeah, it's actually very good pressing. They want it back as quick. Shapes to shoot. And for sure, that was not one of his best. Manchester United were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. Goretzka. And it's to Bruyne. And here's Kroos. He's in, surely! Can he put it away? They are rampant! Comfort, yet more comfort, easing away. Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. Things looking so easy, almost too easy here. Muscular approach does pay off here. Oh, that's a key interception. Bui. Pressing is high and relentless. Upamakano. Gets away from his opponent. It's Kroos! Oh, impressive strike. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. Uta Meccano. And it's Goretzka. Now Dyer. Played out to the right. De Bruyne, speculative strike, or oh, denied at the last. Manchester United just served up a reminder of how good they can be on the break. Their method is clear. Manchester United with their first corner, the first in the game for either side, actually. Defending of the desperate variety. Great defending, strong and determined. And now a sudden chance to counter. Alexander-Arnold. He'll try from distance. Oh, he really got hold of that. Yeah, it seemed the right range, and I guess it was worth a try. De Bruyne, who's made his mark on this game. And that interception was most necessary. It's their second corner of the game. Casemiro! And he shoots! Oh, terrific save. Yeah, he'll be a little vexed with himself, having done well to get there first. Has faded wide. Ci saranno tre minuti di recupero. Nasrawi. Big chance. Another chance. 
Well, he's kept it out. That's a great save. Well, we were anticipating this. They're very much set up for the counter-attack, and I don't see it changing anytime soon. And this could be the final action of the first half. Well, he's felt that, hasn't he? Gone that show. Chance to finish. And the referee brings the first half to a close. Well, what a half. For one, pretty much ideal. For the other, utterly dreadful. And we're only halfway through. Manchester United have been more or less perfect, I would say. Their manager's all smiles, and he's got every reason to be. Manchester United have continued without Foss to do their thing. They have impressed hugely in the first 45 minutes, and this is the very least they deserve for their splendid endeavours. And we're underway again. And it's Kane. Bayern Munich, disappointing in the end there. They lack urgency. Goretzka, out to the right. Short changes him with that pass. Musiala, now it's Kane. Played out to the left flank. Couldn't quite squeeze that one through. Neuer. Neuer sends that a long way. Now it's Tony Cruz. Has a look and has a go. Keeper always had the measure of that. Another example of how comfortable this team is on the break. Manchester United, they're up to five corners now. And that has earned a reprieve for the time being. Bayern Munich can start a counter here. De Bruyne! Goal! And so clear that one side are so much better. The scoreline entirely justified. It's a mass exodus now. Certain sections of the stadium are leaving in droves, and you can't blame them. Manchester United, totally rampant here. They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing department. There's the delivery. Keeper has taken decisive action. And there's his chance to lead the counter. Chiesa, that's a little off target. Well, quality clearly deserted him at the crucial moment. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. Played out towards the right wing. That's been cut out, well played. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Oh, good spread. Challenge just a bit on the firm side. Now it's De Bruyne. And De Bruyne! Loose ball now, and there's a chase on to retrieve it. No way through, so... There's the hit! Brought out the best in the keeper. Look, it, it was achievable, Peter, but it needed his best. 
Looking for options for movement. He's had a hit! He would have been quick to recover this. Bayern Munich are stuck in Central Station and they might find a fast track out wide if they care to look. Garnacho! And he seemed certain to get the sixth. Manchester United certainly look a bit close with a definite foul there. Cambio di giocatori. And they win it back again. He is through here. Picked out son of goal. Well, he got rid because he was under pressure. Time then for the first substitution of the game. Benzema coming on here. A change that was broadly anticipated. Yeah, I think the manager might have feared his team could become a little tentative, conservative even, Peter. But this will make a nice change. Shot for Chiesa! Oh, denied at the last. Oh, it was the first touch to die for, and it set him up beautifully. Chooses to go cross-field. And it's been taken straight back. There's a sharp little ball here. Great leap! And that's past the post. Goretzka, Musiala, Kane, and it's Sané. Ah, he's had it taken off him. Ah, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Upa Makano. Luciana. Out to the left it goes. Towering header. And the chance goes to waste. Sunny, looking to break out here. Solid defending, refused to be outmuscled. Robertson has it in a wide position. Gnabry. And Sunny. Played back in. Great ball, has a shot! No, it's wide.
Upamakano. Added time going up here, it's three minutes. And it's Sané. So that's it, it is all over. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. Chiesa voted man of the match and deservedly so. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Manchester United kept such a, a high defensive line and squeezed the game with, with really good pressure on the ball and it made the big difference. It helped them to control things to their liking and they look comfortable in it for me. My well, thanks to Jim alongside me and as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you.
Well, good evening to you and welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football to which we look forward immensely. It's hardly a surprise that everybody has come here in their droves, this being a fixture that has received so much coverage in the days leading up to it. And it's good to see that we have a good contingent of visiting fans by the look of it too. The atmosphere is amicable, the conditions do bring out the best in everyone, and I think we're all looking forward to a feel-good game. And this, of course, a part of the European scenery known for its great noise. Milan, the grand shrine to the game, the Giuseppe Miazza. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Well, someone who could ignite this contest is Stefan El Shirawi. Uh, he usually starts from a wide attacking position before cutting inside with a combination of, of pace and skill. And he's more than a decent finisher too, so keep an eye on him. Okay, interesting. the whistle and here we go well that tackle was certainly sturdy out to the left it goes they've got to be quick moving this forward Chiesa Closing in. Can he finish? Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Well, I think the opposition was pretty sloppy in creating a problem for themselves then, but he was onto it so quickly and, and very nearly made them pay. And we have our very first quarter. That's just playing it safe and simple. Robertson chooses to go cross field. Now it's Chiesa. Real chance. Oh, shooting chance. Goal, Manchester United. Manchester United take the lead. Just the sort of forward pass he's been looking for. Very telling.
Roma didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Paredes. Not the most accurate pass. Well, that looks a decent ball. Spread out to the left. Mancini spots it and intercepts. And it's Dybala. Now, who's going to be first to this? He's got away. Showing good feet. Casemiro proves too strong. And here's the chance to counter. Well, played right into his path. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. Paredes. Dybala. He's had a fair tumble under that challenge. Cristante. Interesting ball. Garnacho. He is through here. Paredes did just about enough to come out on top there. Neither party overly willing to compromise. And the follow up. It's in. Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. Sharp, simple, satisfying. He just knew what was on. Our oh, players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great poaching positions. <laughs> How quick minded is that? that? Manchester United get themselves a two-goal cushion. We're looking at a very different game now. The command has been established. Oh, that was one big no-no when you've got a queue formed in the box. Dybala. Mancini. That's really good energy, Peter, the way they defend from the front. Well timed, excellent interception. Chiesa, shifted upfield. Angelino. De Bruyne wins the duel this time. And back in possession and ready to go again. They want to make the most of this turnover. Pellegrini, he's left his man. And here's Lukaku. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. And it's Dybala. Now it's El Sharawi. Loose ball now, and there's a chase on to retrieve it. Up to meet it! And that interception was most necessary. Out to the right. Gets away from his opponent. Chiesa! And that is certainly not what he had in mind. Chiesa knew immediately he didn't catch that to his liking. And his face was a, a picture of dissatisfaction. Karsdorp. Manchester United heading towards the half-time break. The wind very much in their sails. 
Dybala. Robertson did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. It's the sort of situation that they'll want to capitalise on now. He's found a way through. Karsdorp. In comes the cross. And he was alert to it. Could move up a gear here. Now it's Chiesa. De Bruyne. And De Bruyne! Oh, terrific save from the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Chiesa fiddles it through. De Bruyne! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. De Bruyne sparked a tremendous stop. And that'll be the last act of the first half. How's the first half compared with your expectation? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Manchester United sitting pretty here at half time, 2 0 up. Here we go again, then. Mancini. Good pressure. No shortage of purpose here. And to Bruyne! And that has been clubbed away. quick to react they want to be quick here it's breakaway time and he welcomes it in he's shifting through the gears here he's going for goal oh, that was venomous Mancini, Karlsdorp, Robertson really added the width there thanks to his willingness to dish a chance. A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Really was just waiting to pounce on any slip up, and he was gifted a chance. Oh, good point. and the finish and that is doing no harm at all well we were anticipating this they're very much set up for the counter attack and i don't see it changing anytime soon and the pass is intercepted it's looking to set free a runner into the middle They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing department. He's had a shot! And for a moment, time stood still. Well, one sloppy lapse like that can do a lot of damage, and it was triggered by the closing down. punished Goal for Manchester United assegnato al 64esimo minuto numero 9 
3-0 and things are starting to look awfully cosy aimed beyond the defence and the flag has stayed down and the shot big relief it just needed better contact that's the threat he carries Peter running at defences like that if only he managed to retain his composure oh that is asking for trouble can he find the finish and how did he not make it for oh I'm not sure what he had in mind and I don't think he knew either wriggles his way through great skill that's nice can he finish no mistake surely now they are well and truly out of sight well there's always a chance of being caught like that when you surrender the football Roma choosing to make the first change. Well, Peter, I don't think there's anything tactical or injury related here. I think it's just all about the push for the goal now. Things looking so easy, almost too easy here. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Great hit! The message is clear, none shall pass. There's the delivery. Climbs up big! He scored! And so clear that one side are so much better. The scoreline entirely justified. Well, it's a goal fest, and the fact it's so one-sided now is, is getting scary. It's become a case of men against boys. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. No, that was never going to make it. Roma have a free kick. Played out towards the right wing. Good spot, he's seen the run. He is through here. There's the hit. Have their second corner now. Tries a shot! Well, now it's a race for the ball. And now a sudden chance to counter. And it's lofted through here. Now, has he got the real chance? And they're back on the ball again. Back when it goes. Chiesa has a shot! Tony Kroos. Gone Nacho. And he'll shoot here! Keeper always had the measure of that. Shot away. Oh, there was plenty on that. Paredes.
Angelino. There will be four extra minutes. Had a shot. Well, he caught that pure, but no end product. Paredes, Christensen, to Pellegrini, Tony Kroos, sends it forward, Garnacho, and the shot! Oh, terrific save. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Well, a great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their pretty pictures. Only one team in it. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Manchester United kept such a, a high defensive line and squeezed the game with, with really good pressure on the ball and it made the big difference. It helped them to control things to their liking and they look comfortable in it for me. And that's where we have to end it. From me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you all. Well, a very good evening to you wherever you are. I do hope that you can join me in appreciating this truly beautiful evening. A night that is absolutely ideal for a game of football. The scenes here really are something. A beautiful picture under the floodlights. Traffic and transport round here, not the kindest. But regardless of that, the fans have found a way of getting here. There is a sense of theatre and the decibel levels are rising. And there really are few places on earth quite like this. The grand cathedral of football that is the Giuseppe Miazza. How are you reading this formation, Jim Beglin? Well, this setup, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protective layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter-attacks if you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot. It can have a, a devastating effect, actually, uh, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. So it's down to business here. Chiesa might just make this. Chiesa lobbed in behind. De Bruyne hit into the towering header. Goal! Manchester United! The perfect outcome to mark his 50th game. header but really it was all about the delivery oh look it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header and if you get it slightly wrong then you'll struggle but that was beautifully met it really was
Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Casemiro. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Oh, easy pickings there. Baran cuts it out. Diogo Dallo. Got Nacho. Now he's off and running. He's played him through. And to Bruyne! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Got Nacho. He's a sharp little ball here. Now that looks a decent ball. He's shifting through the gears here. Played in by Tallo. Brilliantly cut out. Got Nacho. De Bruyne. Oh, it's a nice idea, but the execution was lacking. Chance! Decent enough try. Driving on and making good progress. Oh, the chip pass hasn't quite come off. Bruno Fernandes. Out to the left it goes. Pinches it off him. De Bruyne. Not the most accurate pass. Got that show. Some good work on the right flank here. And the ball's gone astray. Great hit! It's a carbon copy of the previous miss. Manchester United really are in the ascendancy here, and they know they have to register while that's the case. Over to the left, Garnacho. He's had a hit! Oh, denied! Brilliantly! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. And we have our very first quarter. Climbs up big! Another chance! It's in! Two to the good! They have breathing space! Complete awareness. He understood what was needed and he executed it smoothly. Yeah, and I think we may have had too many defenders ball watching then because they just lost sight of the real danger. Things starting to look very comfortable. That second goal is such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Oh, it's a promising build out this. Plenty of really nice pop. Fires from distance. Oh, what a wonderful stop! The keeper really dug out his defense then. A magnificent effort. Garnacho. Truthfully, it was hard to see any better outcome there. Garnacho. He is through here. Tries a shot. And 
the keeper passes the test. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. He's good for goal. That's a fine save. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his his high class wage. Bruno Fernandez. Spread out to the left, Rashford, he's got away, swept in, Bruno Fernandes! It's run loose, who's going to get there? And it's and a second time, sticks it away! Just one goal in it now, game on! What a great header, got plenty on that. Yeah, he makes those runs with, with great stealth and a ghost-like arrival to get his head to the ball. We have got ourselves a game here. Listen, goals change games, and that has changed the whole complexion of this one. They have the momentum now. De Bruyne. Hits one! It's off target and by quite a way. It was very much worth a try, and I've seen worse. That should tee him up nicely for his next attempt at least. Casemiro. Kroos does really well to win the ball there. De Bruyne. That has been cut short. Could try cutting inside here. And the shot! Oh, extraordinary. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Sure. And it's to Bruyne. He's having a go. Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Deep into stoppage time. <laughs> Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half time. So half time, no shortage of action and talking points at both ends of the field. Three goals to light up the crowd and a fair reflection of the territorial state of play with the half time scoreline two goals to one. No, well, the pickings certainly have been rich in this first half. Well, it remains very delicately poised, and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. Manchester United leading by one in a finely poised game. It is intriguing to watch and could easily go either way. And we're off again. Baran wins the duel this time. Maguire. Passes coming off in quick succession here. Oh, just skips past his man. And Dyke did just about enough to come out on top there. Neither party overly willing to compromise. Chiesa. Chiesa! Oh, that is rather wayward. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. Casemiro. He's tried one! And for a moment, time stood still.
That's what all good teams do these days. Pressing from the front is highly effective. Rafael Varan. And it's Shaw. Ball play for Rashford. He's left his man. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Chiesa, there's the shot! And he hits the net! That looks like a preconceived plan. Win the ball and then unleash. And he's done it again. He's got his second. Well, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. Listen, it's up to them now how they think about it from here, because for me, it's crying out for them to force the issue. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Well, learning from your mistakes and not repeating them is never completely guaranteed, but that rear guard is, is more focused on him now. Sure. Good spot, he's seen the run. And he's running through, shot a goal! Yes! And they are cruising away. And a trademark move ends with the inevitable classy finish. Manchester United are such an adept counter-attacking team, they produced something out of nothing there. A few seconds was all it took for them to convert a defensive situation into a goal, and it's very impressive. And now he has two. So now the difference is three. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Maguire cuts out the pass. Maguire. Tries to dink it in. Chiesa gets away from his opponents. Great leap! Harmlessly behind. Well, we were anticipating this. They're very much set up for the counter-attack, and I don't see it changing anytime soon. Ball has bounced loose now. He's found the way through. Looking to go deep. That's a decent clearance. Casemiro. And that's been intercepted. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Played back in. Bruno Fernandes. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Manchester United can now introduce the first of their substitutes. 
Mbappe to come on, a change that has been mooted for a while. Yeah, he's looking for instructions, probably something along the lines of go make a nuisance of yourself. Manchester United have a free kick. Benzema gets his final warning. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. Tony Kroos. Yeah, they were looking for a counter-attack. And here's Benzema. Oh, shooting chance! He scored! Result no longer in doubt. It's just about how many. The breakaway clinical and clean. And the finish unerring. Quick, decisive and unerring. A textbook example of, of how to turn defence into counter-attack. That'll do for me every time. And it didn't take him long. Just sitting on the bench and waiting moments ago, already he has scored. That's just as the manager would have seen it. An impact sub. So time for change. And this one has been on the cards for a little while. Well, to wait until now to make this change seems a bit baffling. He's expecting the miraculous to turn this around from here. Manchester United tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Benzema, he is through here. Oh, such decent hit! It's run loose here. They're back in possession and ready to go again. Chance to finish. Oh, almost a sixth. Look, it, it was achievable, Peter, but it needed his best. Cambio di giocatori. So there's going to be another change here. Pressure already building up here. Gets his pass away. Benzema. It's Benzema! And that's past the post. Well, I think a little eagerness just got the better of him. He may have been thinking about back page headlines there. Nacho. Well, it looked promising for a moment, but it came to nothing. And here's Benzema. And the ball's come loose. Speculative strike. Oh, he's kept it out. That's a great save. He's not got that quite right. Bruno Fernandes, excellent challenge there, uncompromising. Malasia. Well, they've got it again. McTominay. Benzema. Madison. Mbappe. Martial, Bruno Fernandes, who has made his impact already. Now it's Chiesa. Alexander Arnold. Can he finish? And that is the last effort of the game. Manchester United have won big and in style. Everything went for them. Their poor opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. Well, what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Manchester United certainly ran a perfect race from start to finish. Out of the blocks quickly, they got themselves in front and they just didn't look back. 
And that's where we have to end it. From me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you all.